Kia ora. Join me as I enjoy an extremely rare opportunity to ride a steam train through downtown Auckland. Within the confines of transport museums and heritage centres, and from time to time on rail lines usually only ply by freight, it is possible to take a heritage train on a sightseeing tour. This is why when I was offered the opportunity to ride a steam train from the Auckland Strand Station, just a few minutes walk from my home, I jumped at the chance. Over the course of four trips throughout the day, the crew from the Glenbrook Vintage Railway and Steam Incorporated took over 2,000 people on a circumnavigation of the Auckland Isthmus by steam train. The journey begins from the Auckland Strand Station, the last remains of the former terminal main station which operated from Beach Road from 1930 to 2003. From here, we pass by the original Auckland A signal box as we pull out of the platform. From here, we follow the North Island main trunk along the Westfield deviation through Glen Innes and Panmuir, built in the late 1920s, which includes the 596 metre long Pūrewa Tunnel. Otahuhu, we lose the locomotive as it turns around in the Otahuhu Triangle while the train crew farewell some passengers and book in some very last minute bookings. Before heading back north via the North Auckland Line through Newmarket and Remuera, which includes the 344 and a half long Parnell Tunnel opened in 1915, replacing the original 1873 tunnel.
final locomotive today is JA1271, one of the last JA class engines built by the Hillside Railway Workshops in Dunedin, completed in 1956 and was active around the South Island until 1971. It was purchased by Steam Incorporated in 1978 and renovated back into running order between 1991 and 1997. The carriages are a variety of styles built between 1909 and 1940, some of which were built in the former New Zealand Rail Workshops in Otahu. 